Hey, Sage Forsaken here. Another review of a toy. The Imaginex Jackhammer and Fire Mech from Rescue Heroes uh, is a great looking mech. It has the four legs, much like a walker in Destiny or something of that nature. It is attached to the heavy loader in Aliens. As you can see here, um, the figure is a firefighter, so that's why the mech does squirt water. It's one of three sad onions. Always good to know. Uh, I only got paid $7.99 for this at Ross. And, of course, you can see these other vehicles and figures are available in the line. We will be looking at the uh, action figure features of the, of the mech in just a moment. But first, let's look at the, the mech itself. Uh, in packaging, you can see pretty much all you have to do is cut that cord to get it out of the packaging. Then you have your plastic uh, holding in your other things like your water disc, quote unquote, that fire from the belly of the mech. And the tank that hooks on the back of the mech will squirt water and goes in that hand that's shorter. Here's everything together. Uh, the figure fits nicely in the mech. And of course you have your water disc uh, will uh, fit on the mech. The back of the is where that pegs right in there. I like it turned sideways like that. Uh, underneath the mech you'll see that the water disc will peg right into that peg and those feet move back and forth so that you can make it a stable position. Just about no matter how you have it, it will stay stable with those rubberized feet. And of course with the Jaws of Life attachment opens and closes by the press of the button. And on the other side, you see that it's kind of like shaped like a fire hydrant top. It does squirt water from there. The uh, discs do not feed into the belly automatically. You have to manually feed them. And then to fire them, you have to turn the mech to the right. Um, which I don't like that they use that for the action of the mech. I wish that it would turn fully around like a 360 on those legs. Because I thought that would be a cooler action. Uh, moving forward, you can see here that it does fit four inch figures. And, uh, you know, um, some figures may look a little bit low in the foot, so you might want to make a, like a foot stand or something for them. And, um, you know, I couldn't resist putting Ripley beside this thing, though she's not articulated enough to sit in the mech, which is a shame, because of course it would have been cool to have her in the mech. Anyway, this has been my review of the uh, Imaginix Fire Mech. Thank you, and have a great day.